So this doesn't work. I can't charge my phone when the RV is on battery power. Let me show you the problem. Oh, hey, I'm just here in my new camp tab 400 chilling in my bed and over there's the plug uh, right next to me, except here's the issue. Uh, the USB only turns on when I've got shore power. That's not going to work. Or if I've got my inverter turned on, which is going to waste all my battery power. Don't want that either. I need 12 volt USB, but there's a problem that is located all the way, all the way over here. That is the only 12 volt power that runs off of battery with the inverter off. And that's annoying because I'm not over there. I'm over here. And that isn't going to work for me. Let me show you how I fixed it. All right. This is what I just added. This is a 12 volt powered USB power center. And I've got two USB A and a USB C right here, right next to my other one. Now this is not going to be on if I'm running on battery, but this one will. And what I thought about is I've got these lights over here powered by this switch. There they are. That means there must be 12 volt power somewhere nearby. I installed this with an on off switch. So when I turn this on, you can see the little blue lights. Almost all of these USB uh, outlets you can buy have these annoying lights on. Great to tell you that it's working, but when you're sleeping, that can be irritating too. And if I wanna use no power, I can switch it off. So here's where you find the power source. All right, over there's the bed and behind this drawer, I should be able to see that. Pull this thing way out all the way and then get now look back here, there is a bunch of wires and stuff. To pull out the drawer, you'll see these little levers on each side that you gotta just lift up while you pull the drawer out the rest of the way. Okay, now we should see a better look in here. So here is what I did. I got a little 12 volt switch and that is powering my USB right here. In order to mount this, I figured out that the back of the drawer stops two inches short of the end here. So I measured and marked and made sure that this was not gonna hit the back of my drawer. That gave me a convenient mounting spot for the switch and the USB outlet. For my 12 volt supply, right up here, every trailer is gonna be different, but in this case, there must be 12 volt going over there somewhere because there's that switch. So I found that that blue wire and white wire with this little connector here, this is what was powering the light switch. So I could tell that that was a positive. So I tapped into that positive wire to power my switch, which powers my USB outlet. For the ground, right beside it was a white wire, which was the ground. And I just used these little wire connectors that made it really easy to tap right into that without having to cut anything. This was a really easy job and extremely satisfying to have USB power where you need it most, right next to the bed where you're gonna be sleeping at night to charge your phone. And this is something I can use without plugging in.